Aaron Cantrell is joining us from Creep Hall Baseball Park, which is colored in red tonight. Not only the color of the Covenant School, but also the color of William Kenny's baseball team. Aaron? Yeah, Carrie, you know, they do miss Will. He was a special kid and they loved him so much. You know, we did get permission from the coach to be right here, a little away from the field because there is a game happening right now. A lot of young kids are here, but you know, Will's jersey is hanging on that fence and it's surrounded by a lot of red ribbons and a lot of red bows. And you know, community members, they want to let everyone know that is involved at Covenant School that they are thinking about them. So now community members are taking red and black bows and ribbons and placing them on their houses and their mailboxes. Finding the right words to say is tough in this situation. This don't happen here. This don't happen here. All anyone can do is offer up a prayer and sympathy to all those affected by the mass shooting at the Covenant School. I didn't know any of these people personally, but when you see those children's faces and you see the other three adults who were mercifully slain for no reason, taken from their families, taken from our community, it's a, uh, it's, it's, it's heartbreaking. But when you are a member of this community. I don't know, it just, this, this hurts. It's hard for people like Michael Brown to turn a blind eye. Every person that has a child in school has this in their mind right now. They have this in their mind. Here at Creve Hall Baseball Park, people are leaving behind red ribbons in honor of nine-year-old Will Kinney. It's something they do as a league anytime they lose a member to represent the team color. I just happened chance to drive by here and see this today. And it touched me and I had to stop and I had to come over here and kneel and pray and try to let God know that I'm hurting over this. And I'm not the only one. The hurt Brown feels is how a lot of people do and the ribbons have taken on a life of their own. Homeowners placing them on their home and mailboxes, red and black, colors used to represent the Covenant School. I encourage every Nashvilleian to get those red ribbons out. Let all these families know that you're thinking about them, that you've got them in your heart. No matter where you place the ribbon, the message is tied together to represent hope, community, and strength. I'm gonna keep mine on until it wears off. And then I may put another one back on it. If it wears off, I may just stick another one back on it. These families need to know that they're in our hearts and prayers. They need to know that they're loved. And I think Michael Brown is how a lot of people feel right now here in this community that may have no ties to the schools or the victims, but they feel it right here in their heart. And everyone is thinking about everyone involved right now. Now here at the ballpark, they have left out some red ribbon and people can come out here at any time to take it, tie together, want a bow on the fence just to let everyone know that they are thinking about them and there are several groups selling bows raising money to go to all the victims involved but you know carrie it's a heartbreaking situation but we're just letting the families know that we stand by them 